Hi YouTube. Today I'm gonna show you my deck, my Yu-Gi-Oh deck. First off, we have Shining Abyss. Level 4, 1600 attack with 1800 defense. Normal monster. Two of them. Next, Human Droid Slime. Level 4, 800 attack with 2000 defense. Normal monster. Two of them. High tech Kyojin, level 4, 1650 attack with 1300 defense, normal monster. Harpy's Brother, 1800 attack, 600 defense, level 4 normal monster. Dark Fire Soldier, 1700 attack with 1150 defense, level 4 normal monster. Jiro Chin Kuwagata, 1700 attack, 1000 defense, level 4 normal monster. Neobuck, 1800 attack, 1700 defense. Level 4 normal monster. Moving on to my effects monster. Mass of Darkness, quick effect. Add one trap card from your graveyard to your hand. Level 2 monster with 900 attack, 400 defense. Fire Sorcerer, quick effect. Randomly select 2 cards from your hand and, re and remove them from prey to inflict 800 points of damage to your opponent's life point. Level 4, 1000 attack, 1500 defense. Kisai Tai, effect. When your opponent's monster attacks this in face down defense position, this card becomes an equipped spell card, equipped to the attacking monster. No damage calculation is conducted. During each of your opponent's standby phase, Increase your life point by half of the attack of the monster equipped with this card. Level 2, 300 attack, 800 defense. Lady Assassin of Frames, Free Effect. Remove 3 cards from the top of your deck from Prey to inflict 800 points of damage to opponent's life points. Level 4, 1500 attack, 1000 defense. Spirit of the Breeze. As long as this card remains in face up attack position on your side of the field, increase your life points by 1000 during each of your standby phase. Level 3 monster, Euro attack, 1800 defense. Nimba Monga. Effect. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, gain 1000 life points. You can also special summon any number of Nimble Monga from your deck in face down defense position. Level 2 monster, 1000 attack, 100 defense. Cure Mermaid, effect. As long as this card remains face up on your side of the field, increase your life points by 800 points during each of your standby phase. Level 4 monster, 1500 attack, 800 defense. Queen's Double, effect. This card may attack your opponent's life points directly. Level 1 monster, 350 attack, 300 defense. Zoiga, effect. When you tribute summon a monster by tributing this card, increase the life points of the player who controlled this card on the field by 2000 points. Level 4 monster, 1700 attack, 1200 defense. 
Moving on to my higher level monsters, I have four. First off, is Sword Hunter. The effect of it is a monster destroyed by this card as a result of battle becomes an equipped spell card. At the end of the battle phase, they increase the attack of this card by 200 points. Level 7 monster, 2400 attack with 1700 defense. Majugret. The effect of it is the attack of this card becomes equal to the combined original attack of the two monsters you tribute for the tribute summon of this card. Level 7 monster, dual attack, dual defense. Another version of it, a better one. Level 6 monster, same effect. God card, Aubrey's the Tormentor. I don't have to intro this. Do I? Moving on to my magic cards. First off, Dispel. Select one spell card on the field and destroy it. If the selected card is set, pick up and see the card. If it is a spell card, it is destroyed. If it is a trap card, return it to its original position. Normal magic. Gravity X. Increase the attack of a monster equipped with this card by 500 points. As long as this card remains on the field, monsters on your opponent's side of the field cannot change their battle position. Equip magic. Remove trap. Select one face up trap card on the field and destroy it. Normal magic. Heavy storm. Destroy all spell and trap cards on the field. Normal magic. Harpy's feather duster. Destroy all of your monster spell and trap cards on the field. Normal magic. Mage Power. The equipped monster gains 500 attack and defense for each spell card and trap card you control. Equip Magic. Sorry for that. Monster Reborn. Moving on to my trap cards. Mirror War. Half the attack of all your opponent's attacking monsters. During each of your standby phase, pay 2000 life points or destroy this card. Rusting the Runes. You can only activate this card if there are 30 or more cards in your graveyard. Inflict 3000 points of damage to your opponent's life points. Widespread Rain. Activate only when your opponent declares an attack. Destroy the attack position monster your opponent controls with the highest attack. If it's a tie, you get to choose. Dust Tornado. Target one spell or trap card your opponent's control. Destroy that target. Then you can set one spell or trap card from your hand. Kunai with chain. Choose one or both of these effects. Activate only when an opponent's monster attacks. Change the attacking monster to defense position. Or you can equip this card to a monster you control. It gains 500 attack. Peter Abacus. 
Each time one monster is sent from the field to the graveyard, inflict 500 points of damage per card to the respective card owner's life points. Solemn Wishes Increase your life points by 500 points each time you draw a card. Mass of Weakness Mass of Weakness Target attacking monster loses 700 attack until the end phase. This is my deck of cards. This is not my main deck. I've lost my main deck and this is my second deck made up of cards which I didn't use for my main deck. I've tried looking for my main deck but unfortunately it can't be found. Thank you for watching.